the unthinkable is coming very soon too. The C801. Let's look at the current predictions. Welcome to Road Odyssey. Please like and subscribe. Visit my Facebook page for up-to-date activities. The first ZR1 teaser video was in April 2024. The second C801 teaser has been published the first week of June 2024. Older articles showed the predicted lineup of C8s. The list was decent and gave an idea of what to expect. Some lists were better than others, but I simply used this one just for ease of exemplifying how the predictions are faring in accuracy. Predictions are predictions, and these have been okay so far. The Grand Sport was deleted, replaced with the E-Ray. The engine specs on the E-Ray and Z06 were incorrect by a good amount, but that's okay. The 5.5 liter LT6 was correct for the Z06. The prediction for the ZR1 was interesting. It says it will have the LT6 and twin turbo. I think most everyone is satisfied with this prediction to this date, being mid-June 2024, although all of this is kind of questionable. Uh, the use of the LT6 should be right. I know the sound clips should very much help predict the engine and type of forced induction. According to several others, they say it sounds like a twin turbo because you don't hear the whine of a supercharger. The most recent predictions have altered a little. I found speculation of possibly 900 horsepower rather than the approximate 800 horsepower. Again, this recalculated 900 horsepower still accounts for the 5.5 liter flat plane LT6 with twin turbos. What's weird is that the media is thinking that an electric motor may be included and responsible for this recalculation of taking the 800 horsepower up to the 900 horsepower. Spy shots have helped a little. There is likely the big wing that will be available. Most importantly are the side intake ports on the rear fenders and the interesting front hood cut inducted for extreme airflow over the front of the car for downforce or possibly cooling. Uh, but these spy shots tell quite a bit. Um, but are they exclusively of the ZR1? I have no idea. But the spy shots and the sound clips from the public do give us more information to go with the GM teaser videos. Here are some still frames of the second ZR1 teaser from this first week of June 2024. I will want to look more specifically at a few of these next up. But just from a quick pass, these pretty much confirm the big wing, the quad exhaust, plus simply speed. For a quick analysis, I start with this frame. Looking at the front hood, I don't recognize anything special. Uh, there's no airflow cut in the hood that I can recognize. May not mean a thing. This is just simply animation for the masses. Or it may mean that the special cutout hood is an option. Anyway, the next frame is just another look at the quad exhaust. Next is the two Venturi-like streams, possibly signifying the twin turbo or supercharger, but here again, still most likely turbos. At least it seems like a signal uh, telling us forced induction for sure. Then a rear shot with the big wing exhaust tips and possibly the two swirls signifying twin turbos. In the next slide, I might be looking at an Easter egg of the LT6 rocket. When compared, the rocket on the LT6 looks similar to the little smoky one in the teaser, but it may be a coincidence. Still, something may be accurately predicted. Finally, I see twin swirls again and eventually end up in one big swirl. So... 
forced induction twin turbos. Well, what do you think about all of these predictions? I think the predictions and leaked information and spy shots have been pretty decent. Uh, the spy shots have really been fun. We do know that the ZR1 has to be an absolute beast. The Corvette C8 variety has certainly gotten into the supercar territory and perhaps has really put the supercar world on notice. All I know is the C8 is a great platform and super fun to drive. So with that, I guess I'll just see you later. Bye.